Pat Yai has some very well-known markets such as Gimyong, Sunsi Sook, the Night Market and Greenway but there are also some lesser well-known markets and this is one of them it's called Yan Yong I think it's only open on Tuesdays and Fridays today's Friday but when I'm inside I'll ask someone for more details so let's go and take a look it's absolutely crazy this morning this is around the time when Thais take their kids to school so there's all that traffic and this market generates a lot of traffic as well there's a million cars and motorbikes and everyone's driving in the uh, traditional Thai way and it really is manic Yunyong Market is known for its second-hand clothes although they also sell new clothes and some of the second-hand clothes are almost like new clothes my, my wife has bought me some stuff here she loves it here she really loves clothes so it's, it's a, a treat for her to come here but she doesn't always return with anything she's very picky and she'll go for everything and on some days there's just nothing worth buying but on other days she finds some real bargains she's she bought me trousers and shorts they're really good condition like new for about 50 baht okay up here uh, gangeng ka san so gangeng is trousers car leg sun short so trousers with short legs shorts 50 baht uh propal bags sisi baht the market has diversified so now they sell a lot of other stuff there's meat being sold here vegetables fruit and over the back it's like a flea market they're saying a lot of bric-a-brac and they often have some quite interesting stuff Kotokrab Salad me but one night grub Oh one sao do I some some one but but give on grub No Hokmong, took one. Tung Tung Tiang. Okay, cock and crap. I just tried to speak with one guy who, who couldn't understand a word. That woman was a bit better. So the market's open on Tuesday, Friday and also Saturday. Opens at six in the morning and it finishes around um, noon. Cotal crab. ซื้อผ้ามามาจากไหนครับมาจากเอ่อฝั่งกัมพูชาค่ะกัมพูชาโอเคพระพระเจ้าอื่นมั้ยเออกัมพูชาที่ที่เดียวทางเข้าเข้
two of these shirts for 100, one for 60. And the things that my wife buys for me are normally indistinguishable from new. Although for the first wash, we normally add a bit of um, disinfectant just to make sure. Something I think a lot of foreigners are shocked by in Thailand is that Thais who are complete strangers will ask you quite personal questions. And in the West, if someone did that, you, you know, you, you probably just tell them where to go and uh, none of your business. Tyres don't like to be impolite like that. So they'll answer, but they'll do so in a, a very vague way. So they're not giving you information, but they have actually responded to your question. So there was a woman just now riding a motorbike through the market and um, she sort of acknowledged me. So I said to her, what, what are you buying? That's like, Su Su Rai. And she answered, Su Kong, I'm buying things. So yeah, she, she answered my question. She wasn't impolite, but at the same time, she didn't give me any meaningful information. I'd like to know a little bit more about these clothes and where they come from. Because when you look, they're almost new. There's very little use. So they're not really secondhand in the traditional sense that they've been used and then discarded. I suspect maybe that they're either returned items or they're items that haven't passed a quality inspection. So they may not be perfect, but they're pretty close. And at this price, you can't really complain. Unlike my wife, I am completely uninterested in clothes. There's nothing I hate worse than going clothes shopping with her. So I'm going to leave the clothes behind and then go and look in the other section of the market where they're selling other stuff apart from clothes. I'll give you a Google Maps link in the description so you can find this place. And if you're driving here, I would certainly not suggest trying to park right inside the market. It's just a nightmare, uh, traffic and parking. I parked about 300 yards away uh, and walked. This is something that my wife and most tyres won't do, but I'm, I'm quite happy to do that. Just park in a convenient space and then walk the, the, walk the rest of the way. These Buddha images. And other Buddha type things. Oh, amulets, the same as we saw underneath the um, railway bridge recently. Lottery tickets, more amulets, more amulets. Kids toys and backpacks, bags, more amulets. One of the things I like here are the old um, coins and banknotes. Uh, more used kids' shoes. I've got crockery over here, cups and plates, power tools, paint brushes, saws. Cups and flasks. Some of this stuff might be useful, but a lot of it is just junk. There are more ha uh, household appliances here. Looks like a, a very old Philips DVD player. Philips toaster. An old mixer. Old Christ Christmas decorations. I have to remember to so come back here in December. Leather wallets and bags. Leather belts. 
belt buckles. What we got here? Oh, American Marines, California, Circle Bar Ranch, more kids' toys. So, what do you grab? <laughs> oh, I'm on coins and watches. <clears throat> I guess if you um, know watches, you could probably find a bargain, but you really need to know what you're looking for. Poor car, Jamaica. So many things for you to look. Oh, yeah, lots of things. Yeah, a lot of things, right? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. There's a ceiling light fixture. <clears throat> Some old wires. A very ancient mouse. A case for eyeglasses. Oh, so, um, some old Nokia mobile phones. I don't think tyres ever throw anything away. You know, they seem to have a philosophy that anything can be sold. More clothes. What's this? Quite an ornate ornament. Old mirror. Some porcelain elephants and turtles. And stuffed bird. A wooden clock. Even if you don't intend to buy anything, which I don't today, it's quite interesting just looking around. Guys dressed up like a, a Civil War soldier. Where do I come from? England. England. Yeah, where do you come from? Songkla. Oh, Songkla. Songkla province. I, I, I was born in Songkla about uh, 60, 65 years ago. 65? Oh. Si uh, no, no. Uh, si 60, 65 uh, Yeah. Ago. Okay. MP, Hoxip Ed. Oh my, older. Older, yeah. Yes, young See. brother. Yeah, I'm your young brother. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, how, uh, how long you stay in Uh, uh 19 years. You are always in uh, Thai lady? Yep. Thai lady, you look beautiful and lovely. Yeah, oh, they're all yeah, beautiful. beautiful. Thai ladies, all beautiful. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Jai Di Doi. Yes. Thai, Thai. <laughs> uh, Sorry, what your job? No job. Uh, no job. Grassy young, grassy young, loud. No job. Uh, in, in this call, uh, without job. Without? No. Sorry, no job. Same, same without job. Unemployed. Oh. Unemployed. Look, look, uh, or, uh, jobless. I am, I am uh, homeless man. Homeless? Yes. Mommy barn. Okay. Okay. Yes, I am homeless. Okay. I'm poor man. <laughs> okay, nice meeting you. I'm gonna look at you. Look at your shop. My friend. My friend. Your friends. Yeah, uh, my friend shop. Okay. Okay. Uh, in this is a real jackrab. I just got. That's the market. I just got one. Ma, one ni ma ma kon diao krab. Oh. Chai. Okay. Chok di krab. Shop's got some quite interesting stuff actually stuff that you probably wouldn't find elsewhere so that's one reason to come here to shop so why, why would you come here so um, a lot of the stuff they've got um, is just basically junk I've, I've got better stuff at home that I'm looking to throw out um, one is the the clothes bargains if you, you, can, you can find something that's in you know almost new really good condition that's very cheap and the other reason is stuff like this it's um it's quite unusual you know you probably couldn't find it easily elsewhere a few things i'm interested in i like the old coins and banknotes the genuine ones i've got i've got a few at home and what i really like to get my hands on is some old um negative film of old photos you know taken in in this area or other parts of thailand so i could 
scan them in, but I've, I've never seen any. I don't even know if such things exist. Well, obviously they exist somewhere, but probably in people's homes and not for sale in markets. All these power tools look brand new. Kong Mai, Chai Mai Krab? Kong Mai. Kong Mai, yeah, all, the, all, 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 these, all this stuff is new. So it's not all used and secondhand. Some, they do have some new products here as well. Watches, jewelry, eyeglasses and lighters and an old video camera adapters headphones uh, sports equipment we've got some tennis rackets here <laughs> and they've even got used babies bottles you know if you'd if you just had a new baby would you come here to buy second-hand bottles for your child <laughs> some of this stuff is quite good actually uh, some kids school socks they, they look new and they're five part a pair and I, I pay significantly more for my kids school socks Scissors, bags, earphones, data cables. Uh, jewelry. Falang Thai Roop. As you walk around with a camera, you, you hear tyres all the time commenting on what you're doing and that they think you can't understand, but a few frungs can understand. A very snazzy jacket. It's a um, motorcycle crash helmet. Obviously, no use to um, tyres. Chinese abacus. Wang scowls. Belt buckles, watches. Old radios. Shoes. And back to clothes again. Fresh fruit. This, this lady is preparing jackfruit. These are the original fruit underneath. They're huge and they're called kanun in Thai. Glong lagi ba krab? Sam si pa. 35 baht. Went to Nakhon si Tamarad a few years ago to um, Kanom, the beach resort. And they grow a, a lot of fruit there. And we went out, went out somewhere quite rural and bought a load of jackfruit for 10 bar really cheap if you want to stay in this area there's a hotel the wee weld boutique hat yai although it's not something i'd really recommend to stay in this area but it's entirely up to you i think i've seen just about enough today i'm going to head home try to avoid being knocked down by a motorbike thank you for watching liking subscribing if you have any comments please leave them below and more videos soon hello sorry cup so why do you make up Ha, ha, ha.